Hey, good morning. Just tell me what to bring, man. Uh, <laughs> I got a fairly empty rig this morning. I'm just going on a quick trip. It's three days. You don't need to bring the kitchen sink. I'm going to load up the rig and tell you exactly what you need to bring. Okay, other than the clothes on my back, which includes socks, boots, nice flexible pants, a very comfortable shirt, and a warm jacket, this is all I'm packing in terms of a change of clothes. It's only three days, I don't need to bring my whole wardrobe. I have a change of socks, gloves, because it's gonna be cold out there. If you have cold weather, don't mess with it. Make sure that you have enough to keep you warm. In the summer, it's a little more flexible. In the winter, you wanna make sure that you're warm. So I have gloves. I have some thermals, high-tech stuff to keep me very warm. I've got my toiletries. Now, honestly, this bag is just about em empty. I have my medication and I have my toothbrush and that's it and then a jacket to keep me warm. That is it. That is all I'm bringing in terms of clothing. That's all I need. You need your basic sleeping kit. I have a compact pillow, a relatively simple air mattress, and a sleeping bag. Mine has a, mine has a hole in it, but it still keeps me warm. This is a 32 degree bag. If you're in colder climate, get a better bag. Oh, pro tip, are you tired of trying to fit your bag back in the stuff sack? I have a suggestion, don't. Um, <laughs> it annoys the heck out of me. Uh, I have a large bag that I put all my sleeping gear in and I just put it away. I'm not backpacking. I don't need it to fit into a ball this big. I just throw it in this bag. I'm all good to go. Bring a basic set of tools. You don't need everything I'm about to show you, but I put this together over the years. It's already packed, so I just stick it in the truck. A full set of screwdrivers, torch, mirror to help me see in case I drop a bolt, bring fuses, I have a hacksaw, velcro, I bring another motivator with me, channel locks and pliers, I always bring zip ties, I've got larger industrial zip ties as well, razor, more motivator, electrical tape, a full set of sockets and wrenches. Good set of gloves, tree strap, snatch block, D shackle, chain. Kitchen kit. It's in a clear box so we can see what's in it. Jet boil, boils water fast, extra propane, cooking utensils. Boom, it's a kit. Just buy an all in one kit. Cup, bowl, towels, napkin, more cooking utensils, simple pan, multiple ways to start a fire. We call this a little bit of Humboldt County because that's where I grew up. Aluminum foil always comes in handy. Garbage bags and I don't know what the hell that is. Okay, for food, um, you know what you eat? Pack what you want. Uh, for me, I, I don't like to spend a lot of time in base camp doing dishes, so I keep it fairly simple. A lot of grab-and-go food in the morning is a granola bar, maybe some yogurt if I'm taking my time, definitely a cup of coffee, but it's really basic. If I go on a three-day trip, then on one night I'll cook a hunk of meat. You know, I'll do cooking one night out of the three, otherwise it's boil in a bag or something that is really easy to make and doesn't create a lot of dishes because that's not what I want to spend my time doing. If I go on a longer trip and I'm going to be at a location for a number of days, 
I might change that a bit and spend a little bit more time setting up the kitchen, but if I'm on the go, which I often am, I keep it very basic. Before you buy light bars or a lift, buy a good first aid kit and make sure it's accessible in the truck. Okay, water's a you never know topic. Uh, bring more than you think you need. Two gallons per person per day is good. That's a nice safe uh, amount. If you have pets, etc., that takes care of all the other needs as well, not just for your drinking. And bring light and don't forget your mountain money. All right, that's pretty much it. This is not a minimalist trip. Uh, we're gonna go through a minimalist trip in a future video. It is possible to go out for a few days with just three things. Can you guess what they are? Let's get going.